Gosh, Graham, no, I no, don't know. Uh, no, it's time. Tuesday. It feels like Wednesday, Thursday. It's not. That's how it feels to me. Instagram won't be live on all this issue is. Charlotte on Instagram. One more time. Take off my lock on Facebook is better. <laughs> But I'm gonna be in Canton this weekend, guys. That's this weekend. You're now. So if you plan on coming, I'll be there Friday for a little while. Come say hey. Um, I'll be doing my live video there. So all of you guys that don't get to go, I'm gonna show our booth. I'm gonna kind of talk about what Canton is, I'm gonna kind of show you around our booth, some of the stuff that's there. There's a really cute booth across from our Arbor 2 booth. Um so I'll be able to kind of explain to you guys who've never been, kind of what's going on. If you do come um, any day, even if I'm not there, mention my name, and we're going to give away um, some gift bags to the first 100 people who see us. And also, I'll do a giveaway on that video, as I always do. And I'll um, have two extra of these bags. So I will give away um, one on Instagram and one on Facebook during that live. Um, it's got my favorite color in it, sea glass with a clear coat, a brush, and a little sand and sponge. Um, so it's a fun little gift. And we can kind of try Dixie Belt and see what the hype is about. Um, today, I want to like, share, and comment your favorite flower. Because I'm painting a flower. Um, also in Canton, if you guys say my name or you mention, hey, I want to use Scarlet 30, you can use a 30% off coupon even there in Canton, but today our better coupon is Memorial Day. It's Memorial 20. It's Memorial 20. 20 it gives you 20% off and free shipping. So most likely that'll be better than my code, but you can free do shipping over 50. free shipping over 50. Yeah. You can do the math and see what's better. Um, this is a flower and we're not sure what it is. What so is your favorite? You can say what your favorite was. A peony. Really? Peony what? Flower? Yeah. I like magnolias. I kind of always mm -hmm. had a thing. That's my second. Yeah. I'm an azalea person. Yeah. Yeah, I like azaleas. And if hibiscus weren't so nasty, like when they start falling off and stuff, <laughs> I, I like the look of them, but they're hydrangeas. Why are they nasty? I don't know. They just, I, I probably had to clean up a lot of them Messy's when I worked at a water, water park. And, yeah. Uh, they don't live through the winter, so. And they look pretty, but. Well, that's funny that you say that because litter. we're not sure what this flower is. We think it's a poinsettia, <laughs> which is Christmas, but I'm painting it like a hibiscus, even though it's shaped nothing like a hibiscus. Sunflower. Why is it sunflower? It could be a sunflower, but Why it's Why don't you paint it like a lotus? I don't think they were, say, they were saying they were <laughs> um, It's going to be a hibiscus because I really want a hibiscus, guys, and I have not been able to find one this year. Isn't that terrible? Like, is there a shortage? Should COVID ruin high hibiscus too? I can't find them anywhere. So COVID, yeah. I have a perfect little spot for it. So I'm going to paint the center. And Daisy. And I did a little, um, the base of my flower is probably going to be this coral. So let's start, start with red around. And then pink. This is peony, my favorite flower. Yeah, I said, I bet you can find one in Canton. <laughs> Maybe so now. Probably, but I need to go to Canton and not spend zero dollars. So we'll see. I'm just blending these colors together, kind of swirling. Calla lily. We'll see. I don't have a lot of hope for myself because if I did see a hibiscus for the right price, it would be hard to walk away. Not expensive. I mean, I wouldn't spend over 20 bucks. I just really don't need some money. But we'll see. Maybe I can talk to Adam to buy me a flower. Whatever. Um, I'm going to add some more peony because I want it more pink. And I'm going to kind of start to blend this up into each of my petals. 
disclosure, don't know what I'm doing. It could turn out like garbage. There is always that um, risk when I'm painting because I never have a plan. And like, this isn't even hibiscus at all, but it's just a I crazy a random flower like shape, but I'm painting it the color of a hibiscus. So we'll just, we're gonna see how it turns out. I think they're a sunflower or poinsettia. It could have been a sunflower. I gotta admit, okay, I love sunflowers in person. If I had a sunflower patch in my backyard, I'd love it, but I don't love them as decorations. I think your husband would love the sunflower patch too. Well, he's not shooting doves out of my yard, so <laughs> I already know where that's, that's exactly where your thoughts are going. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Your mom said it could be clematis. Uh, clematis. clematis. What is um, that? It's beautiful, and I don't know exactly what she's talking about. It's a, you need some clematis. It's purple, lavender and purple, and you get like a trellis and it grows up on it, and it's so stinking pretty. It is pretty. I'm gonna plant, um, you like put your little trellis up on your fence or something and plant it, and it'll kind of crawl up it. Okay. Um, that should be. Definitely need to look into this. Yeah, because that's his favorite color, guys. I see this. Look, this is neat. Look how it goes. Yeah, and mom's looks like that. She has a massive clematis bush in her front yard. Yeah, yeah, um, look into that. I like that. That's one of the things I want to plant last like weekend. Fancy. Yes, aren't you so excited? I'm going to make a flower dad out of you. Sunflowers, poppies. Poppies are pretty. Poppies are pretty. Um, I'm going to. Look how pretty the purple out there. Look at that. Bro, I know. Look, <laughs> I have just opened a whole new world for him. Thank you, Ms. Deborah. Ms. Deborah's one said something. Yeah, well. But then I'm the one who was like, you'd like it. You wouldn't have known. I probably wouldn't have looked it up if you hadn't. Yeah, so you're welcome. Thank you. All right, this is Flamingo. I'm blending down. Diane Dawson, she has two of them, two clematis. Yeah, Mama has the dark paint, uh, dark purple and light purple mixed in together. Um, and I have a little spot. Guys, I told my mom, I think I worked the hardest I've ever worked in my life last weekend. We reshaped our flower bed and, and yeah. added dirt. And I, so our brick, because our house is 70, 60 years old, um, and the brick was probably, like the brick flower bed board was probably laid then. It was way too close to the house. So I had to dig it up because it was pretty much covered and move it out. And then like dirt, I added a new flower bed. I have no idea what I want to plant in them. I'm like, might even, even though it's not build across related, it's a build across conversation. Um, I might post it in the group and be like, guys, help me figure out what I should plant in this flower bed because I don't know. Um, but I'm really excited about it. And clematis is one of the things I want to add. I just got to get me like a trellis. I think I need to do that. Think you can probably find a trellis in Canton too. We should look while we're there. A trellis is the thing that goes up in you. Yeah, it just needs something to climb on. Yeah, okay. I can even build one of those. Yeah, you could. I say you can buy I mean, one. At, you can it's also it's buy. Nice um, um, you can also buy like a black wrought iron one from uh, Lowe's for like thirty bucks. So okay. you decide if it's worth you building. You know, or just going to pick one. Yeah. <laughs> so, that's I mean, that's I a you might on. enjoy. I don't see you as a really I'm like. Not at yeah. All. So you just might head over to Lowe's. I'm just <laughs> blending these colors together. Flamingo was my main color. That is such a hibiscus color. I mean, said you could use an old gate too. I think I like the gate. That'd yeah, you could. Cool. I mean, you could just plant it growing up on your fence, really. See, like I have a little fence right on my front porch. That's where I, I was thinking. You of can course, just I would like more of them around. You, know, you can yeah. literally just grow it up on that, and you can um, add like little finishing nails just to kind of loop it around. To it, and it'll take off, but to kind of train it. Okay. Um, could you I'm, like tie it to the fence? Or yeah, yeah, you could, or zip ties actually is what zip you should do. Uh, I don't know why I was thinking nails. Zip ties is what I was trying to say because that's how we have our, um, I planted jasmine and it's growing up um, around jasmine our. smell good, is it? Yeah. This one smells good. Huh? And um, it's around our swings and stuff. And um, I just have zip ties. So I'm wetting this brush a little bit, guys. I don't want to know what side of the house the flower bed is on, you know directions is it northeast south or west i'm guessing that's why okay it's it would get morning sun this flower bed that i'm talking about and then i have another flower bed that gets evening sun so 
And I really want to plant flowers, like something with color in it. I'm okay. I want other stuff too. But if y'all have flower recommendations, please let me know because right now, like my front yard is complete shade. So I usually can't plant anything like flowering in there. Um, so now that we've done these flower beds, I'm like ready to do something fun. I feel like I should paint this black. I, I kind of felt the same thing. Definitely needs to be interested. I, um, I like my yard now because the house we just moved from, uh, it was too shaded. Like I didn't get any sunlight. We didn't really grow anything back there. It was, uh, but now I have a lot of sunlight. Like it's, it's exposed and the, the yard's fuller. It's greener. It's nice. It's, it's nice. I have I like sun it. in my backyard, but my front yard has three, which I wouldn't trade for the world because I love them so much. Three massive live oak trees. Yeah. They're so beautiful. And they have the resurrection fern growing on them. So southern and cool. It was one of my favorite parts of the house. But, you know, with that is a lot of shade. Ms. Deborah said she loves azaleas, but don't bloom long enough. That's my my favorite too, Ms. Deborah, is azaleas. Um, and it's probably because of the Masters Golf Tournament. It's known for the pretty flowers and azaleas and stuff. And they That's always make sure they're blooming wild. the week of the Masters. And it's beautiful. So that's one of my favorites. Like I said, along with the new are my two. And we have that tree in our front yard. So that's. Yeah, it's funny that as like boys, y'all's favorite flower is like a bush. And like our favorite flower is a flower that you would pick a lot of times. Uh, I do want to grow a peony. I'm just uh, still kind of trying to find the perfect spot for it. But I really wish I could hurry up and do that because peonies. They take like two years to even get started. Really? Um, yeah. So, like, they won't bloom, like, at least I know what for the first year. Flower? I love moonflowers because they bloom at night. I've never heard of a moonflower. Me either, but that's cool. Like that. All right, guys. So, just do this outline in black. And oh, I'm going wow. to try to dry it a little bit. Oh, yeah, that is pretty. I kind of was thinking that it was purple. Scarlet, you need to do some sparkle wax on the black piece. Some what? Sparkle wax. Oh, yeah? I haven't used a good brand of tea yet. Oh, yeah, I saw it look like a potty bag. Yeah. yeah, I haven't seen it. Yeah, I mean, I haven't found, I don't have the perfect thing to do that with yet. There's a circle in there. Yeah. Plain circle. We can make it a wood grain circle. I wonder if it works or if it's just like a demon. I'm sure it's going to work. <laughs> I'm sure it works at Dixville. Um, so. Yeah, I'm going to try a pretty green one. Because I know it's kind of hoping the glitter in it will kind of bring out the colors of my whatever. Well, it doesn't have a name. What's it called? Uh, so what's Scarlet's flower. Poinsettia and hibiscus. It's a hybrid. Poinsettia. 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 Hibiscus. <laughs> it's a hibiscus. Hibiscus. Alright, so I have this color and I'm I just do this with my, um, gosh, I wish I could see that. It's so pretty. Hopefully it'll show up. Oh, yeah, y'all are going to be able to see it. This lady says, I love all flowers, but one of my favorites is sunflowers. I can't go by a sunflower field without smiling at them. That's fine. Sunflower fields are super happy. And I very easily could have painted this a sunflower for you guys because I know y'all probably would have loved it. I've been hibiscus has been on my mind because I've been searching for one. I really want a little one, a little hibiscus tree that's braided. So maybe that's why I can't find one because I'm being too particular. But any other year I've been able to find those super easily. I don't know why. I love the way this stuff smells. <laughs> What's this smell? Which one is it? Oh, yeah. It's, uh, it's like a citrusy or something. No, this is, is not a citrus smell. Okay. I don't know why. 
there is a situation there. Hmm. What's that one smell? Let me see. I don't know. It's just got a good smell to it. I find it a little bit citrusy, like a little bit. I yeah. Say citrusy. I don't think. You know what I mean? Jared's over there laughing like I'm <laughs> huffing spray paint. Y'all, the spray paint section. Have y'all seen it at Walmart lately? It's locked up. It's in a cabinet, it's locked right. up. Spray paints. Locked up, because they've always checked your ID. I yeah. did get carded the other day for yeah. something, and I'm old. You are <laughs> old. <laughs> like <laughs> this was, old. it was a uh, uh, PVC cement. Like I'm like, is running. it that bad that y'all had to lock it up in a case back here? Yeah, it's yeah. <laughs> I guess so. I mean, out of all your choices, you decided to go to Walmart. I saw that a couple of weeks ago. I saw the paint locked up. But I, I, yeah, you know. I thought you, the same thing you did. Like, what is what are we? And doing? you can't you get know? anybody to help you at Walmart, yeah. so you pretty much just ain't getting spray paint from Walmart because trying to find somebody to unlock the case for you would pretty much be impossible. But Stacey, we're not sure what it is. It's either a hibiscus or a. Poinsettia? It's it's not it's shaped a, like a hibiscus. It's, a it's point, shaped like a poinsettia. It's a point biscuit is what we've called it. What's yeah, called it, named I it. named it a hibiscus. Just a second, you can see the other piece. This is one of the. I want to show things. this to y'all kind of close. Uh, also, like, like share, too. comment your favorite flower. We're about to pick a winner in just a second here. So this is yeah. kind of. Can they kind of see the shimmer? It's shimmery too. Yeah. What's up, Jennifer? My friend. I want y'all to be able to see the shimmer yeah. in it. All right, so. Oh my goodness, it's a phone. Okay, so one thing that's difficult about this is that it's not the same. That's where the phone never there goes. it has a way that it lines up. Um there's one specific way it goes. I was Did aggravated I do it too. <laughs> oh, no, no, I didn't. no, you didn't. That would have been funny. Think this is it? Yeah, that's it. All right, guys. Once yeah, you, you figure it out, you're good to go. Wouldn't it be terrible if I busted it, fell on the floor? <laughs> What's just happened? I like that. All right, let's make some winners. I like to stuff. Oh, man, all right. It is like my highlight. Doesn't matter when. And I could highlight up in my. Uh, let's do it while he's picking the winners. I got one on Instagram. Peace, Shaw Eleven. Peace, Shaw Eleven. Please email us admin at build a dash cross dot com. She said they had really good prices for flowers in Canton too. So when you go this weekend, <laughs> it's gonna be hard. Y'all, y'all will know the verdict one day. Peace, Shaw Eleven. Also, I'm pretty sure my husband's coming with me, so that's not good because he's definitely gonna be like. Mm. I thought he was more the spender. No, yeah. I am the spender. That's right. I'm sorry. I got it. I am I one thousand percent the spender. <laughs> Laura Seraphin Sherman. Laura Seraphin Sherman. Please, isn't that an angel? You're welcome, Miss Pichal yeah. Eleven. Uh, Sarah Film, uh, I believe. Please email us admin at build. What you say? Isn't that an angel? Oh, I don't know what you said. <laughs> Please email us admin at build a cross.com. We just need you guys shipping address so we can ship these to you. And that's all for today. Don't forget, I'll be in Canton Friday. You can use um, Scroll at 30 in Canton. Are you or, going here Thursday for your video? Or are you leaving before that? Are you, are you, I'm probably not leaving until Cork gets off work. Okay. And then um, you can use Memorial 20 today for 20% off and free shipping over 50. So you guys go use the coupons, get you some savings, and I'll see you tomorrow.